Want to hear a pretty cool paint Ford story? So those of you who follow the M22 car know that on September 19th at Arizona Speedway, Sean was running his heat race and lost the motor. Our family was very humbled and very grateful for a very generous offer made by a racer in Yuma. His name is Bill Miller. Brad Whitfield introduced us to Bill Miller, who generously offered to let Sean use his spare motor in the car so that he could race for the weekend at Cocoa Pa. Watch to the end so you can see the special interview with Bill Miller. Tell us about your business, Bill. Uh, Richard Quiddo's Auto Repair. We do all general auto repairs. Uh, pretty much everything except transmissions and diesels. Yeah, right on. Show us a little bit about what you got going on out here. Uh, we got a great job going on here. Booster was out, putting that in. Doing a motor swap and a Mustang. Doing a whole bunch of different work on the Dodge Dart. The Cadillac Escalade. We got cooler lines that are broke. And the, uh, I can't think of the name of it now. <laughs> the old Chevy. The old Chevy. Just doing a bunch of different work to it. Is it Older a, fans and stuff. Is it like a nomad? nomad. That's a yeah. nomad, I'm sorry. Cool. And we got Dylan Whitfield's race car. Oh, let's here. have a look at that. I think we're going to have to put the second transmission in there. Uh oh. Who are these guys? That is George. Say hi, George. I'm mine too, but hello. <laughs> is this George in here? Yeah. All right, so how'd you guys meet? Uh, Cortez. <laughs> Cortez? Well, before that, but I remember him from Cortez more than anything. Yeah, all right, cool. But how'd this whole motor loan deal come about? Me and Brad were driving up to uh, Barona to race, or coming back, one of the two, I don't remember which. Get my age memory shit. <laughs> uh, he was talking about having to maybe go to Bakersfield to get a motor, and I said, who is it? He told me, and I couldn't think of the name, and then he told me the car number, and I remembered the kid. Yeah. I said, hell, that's the only kid in Cortez that passed me clean. <laughs> nice. <laughs> and I asked Brad, I said, well... What kind of people are they? And Brad said they're, they're the best people in the world. No, oh, man, I don't know about that. Yeah, so, <laughs> that's how it all came about. Yeah. Well, hey, I, I mean. Like so much help in the past with stuff like that that anything I can do to help anybody else, I'll do. Yeah, tell us a little bit about that. You were talking to us yesterday about uh, the guy whose uh, memorial that race this is. Yeah, it's, it's the Mike Corning Memorial. I raced with Mike for years. Uh, first started racing with him, I couldn't stand the man. I'd rather whoop his ass than talk to him. Uh, we last ten years, well, we became real good friends. Oh, nice! In the meantime, me and his dad were good friends. Larry, who owned the cars and did all the work on them, well, we popped a motor in hot lap. So I borrowed a motor. Larry let me borrow a motor from him. Wow! Uh, Just change it at the track. Change it at the track. Wow! We ended up. Uh, I think we ran seventh, and Mike ran ninth. Nice. And Larry's a little upset with me. Yeah. So you got any advice for Sean tonight, uh, running your motor? Uh, I mean, what what happens if he beats you? I told him, he, I don't mind if he beats me by a little bit, but if he spanks me and makes me look stupid, I'm going to have motor issues. I'm going to need that motor back tomorrow. <laughs>
<laughs> Sean, you got anything to say? Yeah, uh, Bill, thank you. I never <laughs> properly thank you or shook no your hand problem. for it. It means a lot. Not a problem. We were looking forward to the race. Didn't think it was going to happen, but thanks to you, we Just, so. uh, if I see your pussy in the motor, I'm going to get pissed off, okay? <laughs> I don't think we're going to have that problem. I don't think we're going to have that problem. I didn't loan a motor out for you to just go putt around. <laughs> All right. Well, hey, we really appreciate it, Bill. Um, if there's ever anything we can do to help you, not a problem. Absolutely, it's all about. It is. This this is what we. This is why we got into racing. This and the the Mission Twenty Two work, and uh, you're helping us carry that. This is why I stayed on. in racing yeah. all these years. That's it. That's it. Okay. Well, we're gonna let you get back to work. Um, everybody, say bye to the bye to the world. <laughs> Never see y'all later. <laughs> Get out to Coca Pop, you can see this. Yeah, before tonight. yeah. Thanks again, Bill Miller, for helping us out so we could participate in this special weekend. Thank you, Brad Whitfield, for all your hard work and dedication to the entire racing community.